it's England possession just outside the 22 Grayson to Guskert up comes Cat. Cat with the great opening salvo this is Underwood chasing back goes and Tamak inside his own 22 could it be a try the referee says no must have been so close he's given a five meter scrum and there has to be a question as to whether or not and Tamak got the downward pressure watch this you see here there's a possibility that uh, Underwood may not have grounded it either. It was that close. Carboneau, Lacroix, Dort, misses out Castagnard straight to Sadorni, Saint Andre. Again, well shadowed by Slight Home. Nails his man. And still in play. Off goes Slight Home now. Inside is Ben Clark looking for support. France scurry back in desperate defence. It's with Dawson. Grayson could be an overlap, Delalio, Carling, switches to Underwood, Underwood could go under the post here, has support, it's at the feet of Mike Cat, it was on for the try if it had gone to hand. But we see it here that Rory Underwood cuts back inside, let's just see what the pass is like to Mike Cat. He commits there, really if you get one hand to it they always say you should get two. It was 6-3 at half-time, two penalties from Paul Grayson for England, one to Thierry Lacroix. And early in the second half, Lacroix scored this drop goal to make it all square at 6-all. Thierry Lacroix, only his second drop goal ever for France. A Lacroix penalty made it 9-6, back came England with a Grayson drop goal, 9-all. Then with this Lacroix penalty, France were ahead again, 12-9 certainly got the length it's a huge kick it's a magnificent effort the French players salute the hero at the moment as Lacroix breaks the deadlock and with less than four minutes to go it's France who lead 12 points to nine but here's an equalizing chance for Grayson with the drop goal it's over and he's replied in like kind once more. Paul Grayson, coolly done. This was some kick. And England draw level. Inside the England 22, Carboneau switches it to Perrier, the new man. Still France's ball, Carboneau. Drop goal attempt this time by Castagnet. And that's gone over in turn. What a dramatic finale to this game we're seeing. Thomas Castagnier celebrating early by 24 hours his 21st birthday. The newcomer, his first Five Nations Championship game, may have sealed the victory now.